So this is John Paul bringing you my mammoth project on Minecraft, and I did it on Andersonville. So this is the entrance of the of Anderson uh, Andersonville, as you can see. Uh, these are the guard towers of Andersonville, and these are the guards. This is the deadline or just a fence that they had. And if you if the prisoners over there, those guys are the prisoners. If they were to step to if they were to step over the fence and just cross over like see like this guy he would have just been dead instantly a lot of times kids would work um as guards up here um these are the tents that that the prisoners would live in they weren't really big they weren't like tents that you'd think of now but they people would like squish in together to be in these tents especially in the rain so these are the prisoners. Um, this is um, where the he raiders were hung. And the raiders were people that would basically tell you, oh, come on, we'll, 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 we'll give you food and care and all this other stuff. But then they like, jump you. And sometimes they'd kill you, too, or just badly injure you. This is, um, this is the tunnel that the prisoners would from the movie would try to escape from stretches out all the way over here as you can see out and the prisoners in in the movie were caught when they left they ran they were they ran into a forest and this one guy this one guy got them caught and they came back to the camp. This is the um, the river where the where they get their water from. Towards the end of the war, there was barely any water in here. Um, here's where they the prisoners would use the bathroom, and prisoners would not, unless you were just desperate for water, they would not drink after this part, because. There was just feces here, and just pee everywhere. It's it would it, you'd get sick, so they just go for the beginning and then they just let the rest go there. And they bathe in this water. They do all that stuff. So now for some information on the camp. The camp was is the camp was made close to Andersonville, Georgia. Um, but the camp was officially known as Camp Sumter. It was made it was built in 1864. This camp held held more than 45,000 Union soldiers. And of those, almost 13,000 died from disease poor sanitation, malnutrition, overcrowding, or exposure to elements. The prison was run by, or commanded by, whatever you want to call, whatever you want to say, by Captain Henry Wirtz, and he was the only person tried and executed well, executed for what he did in the camp because the camp had just horrible conditions. They, one of the things is that the Confederate Army, I mean the Confederate government could not provide housing, food, clothing, or medical care for the captives. So in the camp, the men looked out for each other. And so this is I'll I'll give you one last look at the place. This is I'll give you a top view look. This is what it looks like from the outside. And Oh, yeah.
That's it.